Greetings YouTube. Thank you for clicking on the video. If you like what you see here, please do consider liking and subscribing to our little channel. It really does help us significantly. It's been a minute or two since our last video and some very interesting things have happened besides rapidly approaching spring weather in New England. First thing I'd like to cover, and it would be awesome if motorcycle companies watched my videos, but I'm a teeny tiny little channel and I'd bet a whole dollar against it. The reason I'm mentioning this is there's one motorcycle company that has done something really that caught my attention. So much so that it moved the company from a probably not buy category to a likely to buy category. That company is Royal Enfield. And what they did is release a bunch of videos showing how to do basic maintenance on the Super Meteor 650. Think about that for a tick. We have a motorcycle company figuratively reaching into its own pocket to teach its rider base how to do things themselves instead of asking them to take it to the shop. Are there plenty of ways Royal Enfield dealership can still make money? Of course there are. And there are of course those who don't want to be bothered with the maintenance tasks and would rather pay somebody than to get their own hands dirty. But this one act by Royal Enfield has me reframing the classic motorcycle company completely. I will be watching to see if they do this with their entire line. That is a game changer to me. The second bit I figure I'd talk about today are the new additions to the W800. First bit, there is the ST2 deceleration brake light activator. When I was riding around with my brother, he noticed that I often used engine braking, which isn't an issue as long as the trailing motorist sees the closing distance and also decelerates. The ST2 applies the brake light when engine braking is applied without the rider having to touch the brakes. Having this installed on the W should make it easier for other motorists to now know when I'm slowing down, which is a fantastic added safety benefit when it comes to engine braking. Second bit on the W, I will unveil shortly. That is the addition of the comfort seat by Omega Racer. I've had the seat for a while now, but I wanted to keep it warm in the house until it was time to install. I thank you for watching my little video, and I hope to have something longer up soon. Keep the shiny side up. Cheers.